What's going on, YouTube? This is Big Pouncer coming at you again with a nut. It's a pretty nasty day out today. Can't go fishing. It's too nasty and rainy, windy. It ain't raining right this second, but it's coming. But uh, figured I'd take a minute and uh, talk to you about my most favorite shotgun that I have recently purchased and been using. Now, I hunted with it last year, but I had a different barrel on it. And this year, though this past year, this past deer season, I had a different barrel on it then. And I'm gonna tell you, it's nasty. Absolutely nasty. Can't ask for no better. I'm gonna show you what it is. Now, of course, the shotgun that I'm talking about is my trusty Remington 1100 Magnum. This is my Magnum 12. Now, this gun has a 30 inch plane modified barrel most people who get one of these guns they want a 30 inch full choke barrel i don't i don't want something to shoot that tight 40 50 yards i want to hit him with two or three pellets and that's plenty enough to kill him knock him down right then he, most of the time he's dead before i ever even get to him i got to have a little room for error because i am not that great of a shot i might make it look easy on some of these videos but i can kill them but you know dog hunting dog hunting you kill them all day long sitting in a tree stand with a rifle. Anybody could do that. It takes a special breed to kill them rolling up out the bed like I do or seeing them laying in the bed and shooting them like that. You know, it, not everybody could do that. But let me get a little close up and I'll show you the gun up close. There it is. Of course, you got Magnum right there. Nice, pretty wood finish. It ain't got much, no rust on it. All the way up to the tip. And of course, these guns are fixed chokes. If I can get that to focus. Oh, there we go. Fixed chokes. No screw-in chokes in these. Yep, no screw-in chokes in these. But then, you know, who needs a screw-in choke? I shoot modified for everything, including turkeys. I need to wipe it off. But lean it right there. Modified. Can't go wrong with a modified for everything. Then of course, you know, it says for three inch shells, but you can shoot two and three quarter out of these guns all day long. As long as it's got enough pop to, as long as it's got enough pop to make the gun action cycle like it's supposed to. That's all you need. That's all you need. Of course, the button there to let your slide go forward. As long as you keep these things clean, they'll last you a lifetime. Absolutely. <laughs> now, I hunted everything with this gun last year. Everything. Now, it don't shoot light birdshot loads, but if you shoot anything with three and a quarter drams of powder in it, it will bam every time you pull the trigger. Never had a malfunction out of it. Never had a hang up on it. And uh, I killed a lot of stuff with this gun last year. I'm going to throw in a few clips of some deer that I killed last year and some ducks and doves. And I shot doves with this gun. I shot ducks with this gun. Took it to Arkansas, hunted ducks with it. Hunted deer with it all season long and done really well with it.
Now, a lot of y'all who have been watching my channel for a pretty good while, you know, remember that I had gotten broken into about four, a little over four years ago, and they stole all the guns I had. Well, if y'all have watched me for a while, you have seen me hunt with all kinds of different guns, trying to find that one, the right one that I wanted to dare hunt with and duck hunt with and dove hunt with and just, just everything, an all-around gun. And I had a hard time finding it for a little while. Every gun I'd pick up, it'd either shoot high or I just didn't like it, didn't like the way it felt when I got to shooting it or something. But this one, this is the one. This is the one. Now, I also did use this gun to hunt turkeys with this year. I did not video any turkey hunts. I should have, really I should have. I killed a real nice bird on opening day and uh, I called him in from about 250 yards called him in from a pretty good long ways and killed that one and then i went with a friend of mine that saturday after the season went uh come in and i called it a bird for her i put a picture up you know the bird she killed it was real nice it was bigger than one i killed it was a nice bird and uh, she used my gun you know we had a little technical difficulties to start with with her gun so i let her shoot mine and that 1100 magnum bam all you got to do is point it in the direction of what you're trying to kill and it'll lay them down every time, guarantee. But like I say, you can take a gun and you can kill everything on the planet with it out in the bushes. But until you find the one, you will miss periodically here and there, which I do too, everybody does. But don't miss nowhere near as much with this one right here in my hands than I have with others. You know, all them other guns, I'd miss half of what I was shooting at. No, this one here, no, it'd kill them. Kill them dead. Graveyard dead. But, you know, I just wanted to show you the gun for a little bit. I've got a couple more gun reviews coming up that I may do here in a little bit, but we'll, uh, we'll just see how it goes. This is Big Pencil, and we will be back with another one soon.